Good afternoon, seventh grade Patriot parents and scholars. This is Mr. Kelly coming to you from the seventh grade experience campus. I texted you a couple of days ago. Many of you are concerned, wanting to be sure your child does not get left behind due to the quarantines. And I commend you for that. So as promised, I have finished putting together our Google Classroom for my seventh grade English class. And I'm about to go over the details of that with you. The first thing you want to do is to accept your invitation to the class if you have not done so. You should have received that. I think it comes by email. Most of you have already accepted it, but I have a few that have not. So definitely accept your invitation so that you are a part of the Google Classroom. Then to begin working through your assignments, first you'll go to classwork when you log into it. You'll see a tab that says classwork. Then it's a little different than what you're used to. I want you to go to class drive folder. Go to class drive folder. Then you will see a folder for each day. I've tried to make this as simple as possible. And this seemed like the best way to do it. For each day that we've had school, you'll see a folder. And for most days, it will contain four things. Not every day, but most days, you'll see the Patriot Preview file, and that's your bell work. So you'll need to open that up and complete it. Then you'll see a PowerPoint file. That's the lesson that we went through in class. It's the same PowerPoint that we saw in class. So just click through it, and it should explain the concept uh, in a lot of detail. The next file you'll see is your class notes for that date. And I use fill in the blank notes that correspond to the PowerPoint. So you'll want to have those uh, with you as you're going through the PowerPoint. Then the last file you'll see is homework. And yes, I do give homework nearly every day. So look for these four files. Now every day won't have all four, most days will. And you'll want to uh, work through those. You want to do that for every day that you have missed or that you will miss. I am grading, and you are responsible whether you've been here or not, especially now that we have Google Classroom in place. So start working your way through the daily folders, cover every day that you have missed, and continue to cover every day that you do miss. What do you do with the assignments? <clears throat> now, so far, the assignments are not computer friendly. If you have a printer, please print them out and write on them. If you don't, I'll take them however you can get them to me. If you need to use notebook paper and just handwrite it all, that's fine. You can take a picture and email it to my email address here of notebook paper, or preferably the real thing if you have a printer, or you can come out of school and drop it off. But just remember, you are responsible for doing it. We are going to work with you, but you are responsible. So one more time, let me go through these instructions. <clears throat> Accept your invitation so that you become a member of the class. Go, go to Classwork. Go to Google Drive folder. You'll see a folder for each day. Most days will contain a Patriot preview. That's your bell work. You'll need to complete that. It's graded. A PowerPoint of the lesson. Your class notes, which are fill in the blank based on the PowerPoint. And your homework assignment. You'll need to work through each day that you've missed to get caught up and each day that you miss in the future. Submit your assignments, being the Patriot Preview and the homework, to gkelley at msd3.org. If you can't print them out, uh, do, them, do them on notebook paper and then email me a picture of it or drop it by the office. Horace Mann, commonly known as the father of modern education, once said this, be ashamed to die until you have won some victory for humanity. This is your moment. Let's win the victory.